hello everyone now in that video I'm going to show you how to completely set up your Raspberry Pi using Linux or Ubuntu actually it's a part of Linux 14.0 in that video I also set up the SSH using putty as well as command line first of all we have to download the operating system from raspberry official website www.raspberrypi.org in the download section there is a two uh, ways are present one is noobs and another is raspbian you have to download the raspbian okay simply hit the raspbian and here also the two versions are available so i have to first uh, the download the first one download zip i already downloaded it so i'm just cancel it and uh, okay first of all i have to do one thing if you are a ubuntu user then the disk options is already there or the disk applications is already present on your os otherwise you have to download it externally so how could you download it then you can type this code okay so simply open disk So simply open disk new SD card which is 16 GB so guys similarly I just uh, put the 16 GB drive okay and similar way I just format it uh, yeah it should be DOS MBR okay don't change it and uh, don't over it format 16 GB format now after format it properly we have to check in the file yeah in the raspi folder yeah, its folder is empty okay and the next thing we have to do install or burn the G, uh, iso file to the sd card so for burn the iso file you have to do one thing uh, in the document where you just store your operating system and the OS I'm just storing in the Raspi and the Raspbian and here simply right click and open with other applications and select disk image writer select and uh, then you have to dis choose the destination that is your 16 GB drive start restoring restore and give your password system password authenticate after completing this it's looking like that have it on raspberry pi properly so guys i just uh, open my uh, routing uh, router ip and using this app active client table uh, there is the ip address here is the ip address of the raspberry pi and I have to configure the SSH in in the terminal okay so let's configure it it's working perfectly you can you can watch the MAC address and the Raspberry Pi IP address okay now let's configure uh, now let's configure the SSH for SSH installation, the command is sudo apt-get install open SSH client. Okay, then you have to do or you have to give the system password. Okay, then it will be sorry, the password will be wrong. Yeah, it's done. Okay. Uh, now I have to update it I have to update it a little bit and after that after installing and you have to give another command sudo SSH. 
is okay guys now one thing I just want to say while you are try to access the SSH it is not configured in your Raspberry Pi so first of all externally and forcefully we have to configure it so simply open the file in the boot we have to choose the command line and in the command line section and the last in the last portion we have to simply give the IP address IP uh, sorry it's not 198 192.168.0.2 0.2 okay so simply do this and save it okay guys after successfully save the IP address we have to now configure the SSH or just start the SSH in the terminal we have to type ssh pi at the rate the IP address of the pi that is 192.168.0.2 okay now the password for the pi is uh, raspberry okay now the our login page is coming so after doing this install another application which is known as Hooti you can get it on application store simply type is Hooti you just get I just already install it and uh, so in that Hooti I have to enter the IP address that is 192.168.0.2 and the to port 22 make it sure the port should be 22 because the port 22 is for SSH or UDP uh, or uh, TCP UDP control protocol okay so make sure that it, it should be 22 and only clean exit and simply open and the password is oh sorry uh, it's it's lowercase raspberry yeah we got we got it at last okay thank you guys thanks for watching and give thumbs up if you like this video and please subscribe my channel okay, and in my next video I'm going to show you the remote and remotely access your Raspberry Pi okay thank you